Have you ever received a backhanded compliment from someone like, oh, you look nice when you actually make an effort? Or been told some bad news in a cheerful tone to soften the blow? Well, in the same way that people can sometimes say and do things that seem fine at first, but after further examination, not so much. We can also have seemingly positive qualities in ourselves that, if we take a closer look, may actually reveal something negative about us. Are you wondering what yours might be? With that said, here are five common examples of good qualities that may actually just be a disguise for negative ones, according to experts. Number one, brutal honesty. Do people often tell you you're brutally honest? And do you usually respond that you're just keeping it real or saying the things no one else has the courage to? Well, according to psychologist Dr. Jason Whiting, you don't need to tell people everything you think, especially when emotions get negative because brutal honesty actually does more harm than good to your relationships. So be careful you're not starting to it as an excuse to be rude, insensitive, and tactless. Number two, being organized. Clinical psychologist Dr. Ellen Hendrickson says that being obsessively organized or having an uncompromising nature is often a manifestation of unhealthy perfectionism. And while there's nothing wrong with being detail-oriented and making a plan for everything, we should also be mindful that it's not making us too rigid, too uptight, or causing us more emotional harm than help. If you find this video relatable and helpful, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Now, moving on to the next point. Number three, self-confidence. Some people can be vain without knowing it because consciously or unconsciously, they disguise their vanity as self-confidence. And according to social scientist and mental wellness author Anna Lamind, Social media has a lot to do with this. The need to constantly upload good-looking selfies, however, did not create this pretense, but rather, it merely brought our vanity to the surface. Remember, confidence arises from experience, but vanity often has very little basis in reality. Number four, emotional strength. While some may say that crying or getting angry is a sign of weakness, repressing your true feelings isn't emotional strength either. The experts at the Kentucky Counseling Center say bottling up your emotions means suppressing your innermost feelings. There is the fear that you may appear weak or just prefer keeping your emotions to yourself, which is common. But it's like sweeping the dirt under the rug and keeping the lid of a boiling pot. So don't mistake not being able to constructively express and deal with your emotions in a healthy way for emotional strength, because it's really quite the opposite. Number five, being value-oriented. Therapist Dr. Dana Heron for Psychology today explains that we judge others as a way to feel superior to them. And one of the ways is under the guise of imposing our values onto others. Though there's nothing wrong with having strong beliefs, morals, and principles, there's also something to be said about being open-minded and giving people the benefit of the doubt, especially when it's not really any of our business to begin with. So, do you relate to any of the things we've mentioned here? What are some of your positive traits that you think may be negative qualities in disguise? Although we may not always like to admit it, we all have our fair share of imperfections. But what matters most isn't that we're faultless, but that we recognize these areas for improvement in ourselves and put in the work to be better. Wouldn't you agree? If you enjoyed this video, remember to like and share. Until next time, thanks for watching, and remember, you matter. Are you looking for a cuddly companion that brings positivity and mental wellness to your daily life? Get your very own sigh. The lovable plushie is here to brighten your days. It embodies the spirit of Psych2Go and it serves as a reminder to prioritize your mental well-being. Its green leaf symbolizes growth, renewal, and the importance of self-care, whether it's for yourself or as a thoughtful gift for a loved one. Sai is ready to be your snuggly friend through all of life's ups and downs. Buy your Psy plushie today. Link is listed in the description box.